say selenium class 2 introduction to selenium part 2 yesterday we discussed part 1 in that chap in that chapter we discussed three topics yesterday we discussed three topics first one what is selenium second one history of the selenium project third one selenium's tools suit suit of selenium tools in that uh, selenium ide selenium rc selenium web driver and selenium grid next <coughs> uh, same chapter part 2 fourth topic <coughs> see first uh, i will index index the remaining concepts supporting environments supporting selenium supporting environments see yesterday we discussed indirectly today i will provide detailed description about supporting environments next selenium license selenium license next <coughs> advantages of selenium uh, before that testing frameworks testing frameworks and other tools other tools used in selenium next <coughs> selenium environment setup selenium environment setup or you can say configure selenium okay next advantages advantages of selenium next disadvantages of selenium disadvantages of selenium okay <clears throat> see first selenium supporting environments selenium supporting environments see four environments four different environments i will explain concentrate first one operating environment operating environment next application environment application environment next programming environment next browser environment browser environment okay first operating environment yesterday <coughs> we discussed this concept selenium supports uh, can you tell me uh, srivalli selenium supports only windows or any other operating environments windows linux uh, uh, and macintosh macintosh and apple uh, ox etc see mm -hmm. microsoft windows next linux unix flavor next 
Macintosh. Next, Apple OX. Whereas EFT, Unified Formal, uh, Unified Functional Testing, Unified Functional Testing, formerly QTP, Quick Test Professional. UFT supports Microsoft Windows operating environment only. But our Selenium supports Windows, Linux, Mac and Apple OX. Next, application environment. <clears throat> See, basically we have four different types of application environments. Three environments belongs to computer software. One environment belongs to mobile software. See, <clears throat> first one, CUI based. CUI based applications. Next, Windows based. Uh, Windows means not operating system Windows. Application environment window. Observe. Suppose this is Windows based application. Just a minute. See, this is window. Observe Vijaya. This is window, na? Yeah. This is Windows based application. Uh, operating system Windows that is different. Next, this Google. This is web based application. Suppose Gmail. Gmail is web based application. Browser based. This flight reservation application is Windows based application. See, in Windows based, you can find two types of applications. One tier applications. Two tier applications, one tier applications. For example, Notepad is one tier application. It doesn't have any database. Notepad is one tier. Acrobat Raider is one tier. WinZip is one tier. Next, this flight reservation application is two tier. Okay, <clears throat> Windows based. Next, web based. In web based, you can find Three tire and N tire, multi tire. Next, mobile apps, mobile applications, mobile based, uh, CUI based, command user interface, command user old applications. Nowadays, these applications, I think, below two percent. 98% applications, 98% uh, computer applications are either Windows based or web based. Mobile applications different. Okay. Computer software, these three CUI based, Windows based, web based. Mobile based different. Mobile, uh, mobiles also use software, computer software, mobile software. Okay. CUI based, command user interface based applications. Uh, Tushar, just guess. Uh, uh, will that uh, Selenium supports uh, CUI based or not? Will it support? Uh, no, uh, it does not support. It doesn't support. Here, no element concept, no object, only commands. See, Selenium. doesn't support CI based applications. No problem. I think below 2% only that CI based applications. Nowadays, most of the applications are either Windows based or web based. Next, Windows based. Uh, can you tell me, Srivalli, Windows based applications. I uh, will uh, that uh, Selenium supports uh, Windows based applications or not? Yes. Yeah. I mean, uh, not IDE, it's a program based. Mm -hmm. Will Selenium support Windows based applications or not? That is my question. Yes. Don't confuse. No. Some, uh, Tushar. Tushar, I mean. Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, it does not support. It doesn't no, support. Uh, yesterday, yesterday, first topic. What is the first topic? 
selenium support ipv uh, selenium supports web based applications only selenium automates web browsers not windows based applications selenium doesn't support windows based applications what about eft what about eft uh, saujanya EFT supports windows based yes. applications also EFT sir. supports windows based applications also but selenium doesn't support windows based windows Next. based applications sri lakshmi web based applications does it support or not yeah selenium supports web based applications yes. selenium supports web based applications next last one mobile based applications see here one condition uh, we have three types of mobile applications native applications web apps next hybrid applications uh, selenium doesn't support native applications and hybrid applications only web apps see supports mobile applications supports mobile applications which have web forms see selenium doesn't support all types of mobile applications only applications which have web forms this is about application environment okay na srivalli any confusion final conclusion no, uh, tell me selenium supports web based applications web -based and, and mobile based mobile applications which have which have web forms web forms uh, it doesn't support ci based applications and uh, windows based applications windows -based. Rahman, are you okay? Any confusion? No confusion. Okay, Thank cool. you, sir. Welcome. See, next programming environment. <clears throat> See, yesterday we already discussed programming environment. Selenium supports six programming languages for writing programs, means test scripts. Uh, you know that one. Uh, Vijaya, list out list out the supporting programming languages uh, java java c sharp c sharp hmm. python hmm. perl ruby and uh, php good python next perl ruby and php say <clears throat> next uh, whereas that one uft supports only vb script but selenium supports java c sharp python perl ruby php but most of the selenium qa engineers use java nearly 76 percent next python okay next browser environment yesterday indirectly we discussed this one uh, tell me Tushar, uh, Selenium supports only my, uh, module on one, uh, just a minute. Here one note, Selenium IDE, uh, what about Selenium IDE, exempt this Selenium IDE Vijaya, programming, uh, suppose Selenium RC supports uh, these six programming languages, Selenium web driver supports, but what about Selenium IDE? One of the tool in Selenium suit. Uh, it's a, it's a five Selenium or, IDE, no. It doesn't support any programming. No. It can be. Uh, in Selenium IDE tool, no programming. Isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Selenium IDE. 
doesn't support. Ah, doesn't support the programming language. Any programming. Any programming language. Uh, what about Selenium Grid? Selenium Grid not for test case design, only for test execution. Okay. Next, browser environment. Continue to share browser environment. Uh, it does support the uh, um, I and also. Uh, okay. Uh, See now, Google highest Chrome. market share, uh, Chrome. Google Chrome. Internet Explorer. Internet Explorer nowadays in third position. See, uh, ten years back or seven years back, first position. Now third position. Okay, client side only, but server side Internet Explorer is dominating Mozilla Firefox. Next, Microsoft Internet Explorer. Next, see these three browsers only industry leading browsers remaining limited use Safari, Opera, etc. Ah, Srivalli, here also one note. What about Selenium IDE? See, Selenium RC supports. IDE supports only Firefox. Yes. Selenium RC supports Google Chrome, Mozilla, IE. Next, Selenium WebDriver also supports all these browsers. But Selenium IDE supports only Mozilla okay. Firefox. Selenium IDE is plug-in of. Mozilla Firefox on Mozilla Firefox only we can install and use Selenium IDE. See Selenium IDE supports Selenium IDE supports Firefox Firefox browser only. Okay. See, we discussed all four environments. Operating environment, application environment, programming environment, next browser environment. Any queries, Saujanya? Saujanya, any queries? No, sir. Okay, cool. No, sir. Cool, cool. Next, next topic. What is the next topic? Selenium license. A, a small topic selenium license uh, Sri Lakshmi uh, does selenium have any license uh, no it's a open source so okay. it is no open source license. software already we discussed open source freeware anybody can download and use but it has some license uh, what is the objective of that license I will explain See, all Selenium projects, means Selenium IDE, Selenium RC, Selenium WebDriver, Selenium Grid, these are Selenium projects. All Selenium projects released under the license, uh, under the Apache 2 license. All Selenium projects released released under Apache 2 Apache 2 license okay <clears throat> say we discussed it is open source suit suit of software tools then why this uh, Apache 2 license what is the object of Apache 2 license say observe the points anybody can download anybody can download and use all selenium projects all selenium projects with free of cost okay Next, 
anybody can modify the source code suppose if you want to uh, modify the source code you want to update some features your your company having programming experts want to modify the source code yes download the source code and modify according to your requirements no issue see anybody can modify modify the source code and distribute the source code see you can distribute this source code to anybody distribute the source code next important point selling modified source code is not allowed that is the main object of apache 2 license you can download and use you can download and modify and use you can distribute to your friends or other companies with free of cost but selling modified code is not allowed that is commercial not allowed see suppose i downloaded selenium source code modified some features after that if i want to sell that code to any other companies that is not allowed Se uh, selling modified code is not allowed uh, sri lakshmi did you understand the objective of uh, selenium uh, that apache 2 license what is the objective the objective can anybody can install it hmm. like i mean to say download it uh. anybody can uh, use their source hmm. anyone can modify Hmm. But uh, they should not uh, sell the source which got modified. Ah, good, good. See, selling modified code is not allowed. No commercial use. Okay, now Krishna Chaitanya, did you understand the concept? Yes, sir. Okay, cool. If you have any queries, ask me. Selenium license. Next topic. Uh, testing frameworks and other tools and plugins used in selenium see here i will list out some uh, frameworks and other tools used in selenium see testing frameworks srivalli yesterday indirectly i introduced this concept see uh, two frameworks are used in selenium you can use any one any one of those frameworks what are those fr frameworks Test NG and uh, JUnit. Ah, first, first JUnit. Test NG advanced. Okay. JUnit. JUnit framework. Next. <coughs> Test NG. Uh, Test NG stands for next generation. Test NG framework. See JUnit. JUnit is unit test framework say unit test framework it is also open source say j unit not belongs to selenium suit test ng not belongs to selenium suit but they are also open source they are also open source and remember java also not belongs to selenium but java also open source say in our test automation using selenium we use all open source software okay j unit basically j unit is unit test framework developers use j unit for unit testing <coughs> but it supports uh, functional and regression testing with selenium see j unit can be used uh, as test runner for 
functional and regression test automation. Next, test NG also same. Test NG inspired by J unit and added some advanced features. See, both are same, same in purpose. Usage also almost all same. In our training, in our training program, we will discuss test NG framework. It is more advanced. J unit also similar. See, uh, yesterday I think last topic indirectly I explained this test NG framework. Just brief, Rahman, can you tell me what is the usage of test NG framework in our test automation using Selenium? Test NG framework is to help us to grouping test cases. Pardon? Grouping test cases. Good. Yeah. Grouping test cases. Next, executing series of tests means executing group of tests or set of tests or suit of tests. See, means batch testing. Ah, any other? You forgot one important thing. Grouping test cases, executing series of tests. Okay. What is the important advantage of test ng? Tushar. Uh, generate reports. Ah, yes. Generating test reports. See, test ng provides detailed HTML, XML test reports. Okay. Next. Uh, we use other plugins also. Uh, first, uh, Firepath. Firepath. Uh, pardon? Okay, I got it. Firebug and Firepath. Firebug and Firepath plugins uh, these are mozilla firefox plugins mozilla firefox say <clears throat> Firebug and Firepath plugins for inspecting elements. Inspecting elements in Firefox browser. Inspecting elements. Uh, what about I and Chrome? I and Chrome having built-in developer tools for inspecting elements. We no need to download and install any plugins for IE and Chrome. They have built-in developer tools. Shortcut key F12. See built-in developer tools. See, this is old version. Okay, later I will show. <clears throat> Next, Saujanya, you have UFT knowledge also. Na? In UFT, which one, which one is used to inspect elements? Elements are objects. <coughs> Saujanya, how to inspect uh, elements in UFT tool? Object repository, sir. Object repository is inspecting tool. Samir, Samir Arora. Krishna Chaitanya. In EFT, how to inspect elements or objects? Using element locators. Using element locators. Object spy. Object spy feature is there now in QTP, UFT, formerly QTP. Can't you remember Saujanya? Object spy? 
No, sir, I do. Sorry. Ah, okay, cool. Say, in EFT tool, we have object spy feature, built-in feature for inspecting elements. But in Selenium, we need to download and install Firebug and Firepath plugins for Mozilla browser. Uh, what about other browsers? Uh, Chrome and IE. Vijaya. They are in there. We don't have to uh, download and install any plugins. Yeah. Okay. See. Google Chrome and IE, IE browsers have built-in uh, tools name is developer tools built-in developer tools shortcut key F12 to inspect elements inspect uh, inspect elements or objects okay <clears throat> next browser drivers driver um, browser drivers for cross browser testing cross browser testing eft supports cross browser testing okay here default driver is what is the default driver sri only in selenium web driver Firefox. Firefox. For remaining browsers, what about remaining browsers, IE, Chrome, Safari, etc.? We have to... Uh, we have to download the, browser drivers the, and set path in our test cases. Okay? Yeah. See. For Google Chrome, for Google Chrome, IE etc etc browsers download browser drivers and set driver path in test scripts okay next test ng also we need to download and install and i forgot one more thing uh, that is important one okay gayatri okay gayatri can you hear me gayatri yes sir okay cool yes sir okay 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 cool put mute yeah yeah see eclipse we use eclipse ide also eclipse ide also This is also freeware, open source. Srivali, uh, do you know this Eclipse IDE? Mm -hmm. Anybody, Sri Lakshmi? Any idea about Eclipse IDE? Uh, I think it, ah. it is also add-on, sir. No, it is not add-on. It is not add-on. It is independent software. Okay. Independent. It can it can you uh, it can be used individually, and it can provide it can provide 
platform for other software also ah okay krishna chaitanya okay say if you want to create and execute java programs we need ide see <clears throat> See in Eclipse IDE, to create and execute not only Java, you can execute Perl, Python programs also using Eclipse IDE, Java programs. To create and execute Java programs, and one more thing, we add Selenium WebDriver jar files also in Eclipse IDE. Uh, just a minute. This is one. To create and execute Java programs. Next. To add selenium add selenium web driver jar files see web driver doesn't have any ide only programming interface we execute web driver programs in eclipse ide or another IDE is also there, NetBeans, etc. But Eclipse is more powerful and uh, open source. See, uh, NetBeans also open source, but most of the Java developers using Eclipse IDE. It is flexible. You add Selenium WebDriver jar files to Java project. and use <coughs> web driver features next <coughs> install see on eclipse ide you can download and install test ng framework but it is not plugin install Test ng or J unit testing frameworks. It is platform Eclipse IDE integrated development environment it is a platform for uh, uh, set up our Selenium environment. You can use Java web driver jar files and test ng annotations also in eclipse ide okay na tushar eclipse ide any confusion tushar uh, no sir okay next come to uh, related topic selenium environment setup selenium environment setup Okay, today I will explain only theoretical steps. In practical chapters, I will show how to configure Selenium. In practical chapters, I will show how to configure Selenium. In this chapter, just theoretical steps. Get brief idea. Okay, before Selenium environment setup or configure Selenium, first we need to choose selenium tools choose selenium tools for example if you choose selenium ide it is not suitable for complex test design selenium rc outdated next selenium web driver is suitable Nowadays, most of the companies using Selenium WebDriver. Selenium ID limited use. 
next selenium rc outdated selenium grid selenium grid purpose is different that is only for test execution parallel test execution selenium id doesn't support test design suppose we selected selenium web driver uh, before that okay selenium web driver we selected selenium web driver to create and execute okay or create execution we will we can use test ng also to create test cases okay <clears throat> Why Selenium web driver only recognizes elements and perform operations on elements. Java doesn't recognize elements. Selenium web driver only recognizes elements. Next, Java as programming language. Java as programming language. next test ng as test runner test ng framework as test runner uh, to execute series of tests and generate detailed test reports <clears throat> next suppose in our project cross browser testing also there for that you can use browser drivers okay before that uh, firebug and firepath plugins for Mozilla browser and <clears throat> Mozilla browser to install uh, to inspect to inspect elements okay next setup environment setup first choose Are you following Vijaya? Yes. See browser drivers, etc. Next, configure Selenium. See theoretical steps. I will show uh, practical also in practical chapters. See, first follow the steps. First step <coughs> download Eclipse IDE. Uh, no need to install. Just extract zip folder, just extract, download Eclipse IDE and extract the folder. In that folder, you can get executable file. By clicking on that executable file, you can launch Eclipse. Okay, in my system, I formatted. Okay, later I will show. Download Eclipse and extract the folder. No need to install Eclipse IDE. In that extracted folder, you can find Eclipse uh, executable file. Click that executable file every time. Whenever you want to launch, click that file. And you can close Selenium IDE using close option, exit option. 
ओके ना तो सर वी नो नीड टू इंस्टॉल एक्लिप्स ना जस्ट एक्सट्रैक्ट द फोल्डर इन दट फोल्डर यू कैन फाइल एक्सिक्यूटेबल फाइल यू जस्ट क्लिक दट फाइल देन इट विल लॉन्च एक्लिप्स आई डी ओके ना नेक्स्ट स्टेप डाउनलोड जावा जावा सॉफ्टवेयर एंड इंस्टॉल सी फॉर जावा इंस्टॉलेशन रिक्वायर्ड एंड इंस्टॉल दिस इज सेकंड स्टेप थर्ड स्टेप सेट एनविरोमेंट वेरेबल पाथ set where in operating system set environment variable uh, that the variable name also path variable why uh, i think gayatri you have idea na you have idea about setting environment variable why we need to set environment variable path why to execute to execute java programs from anywhere yes from anywhere suppose i downloaded and installed java software in c drive some folder i want to execute java programs from another directory if you set environment variable path you can execute java programs from anywhere okay na krishna chaitanya okay okay krishna next <coughs> download download selenium web driver download selenium web driver java bindings see perl bindings python bindings suppose if you want to if you want to use perl download perl bindings if you want to use python download python bindings <coughs> see in our scenario java download selenium web driver java bindings java language binding and add web driver web driver jar files to java project uh, integrate with java project to java project <coughs> say <coughs> download selenium web driver java language binding <coughs> from selenium hq.org website that is official site for selenium projects selenium hq dot org and add web driver jar files to java project where in eclipse id ah uh, vijaya concentrate this point yes ja see here three softwares java uh, web driver bindings java next eclipse we add java uh, we add web driver jar files to java project in eclipse ide okay na any confusion no okay next 
download and install firebug and firepath from mozilla mozilla browser to inspect elements elements next download and set path download ie if required optional chrome etc browser drivers drivers no need to install just set path uh, suppose you download it to your default uh, d drive or e drive just set that path in selenium test case or test script okay that that we will discuss in practical chapter next <coughs> for mozilla for mozilla firefox no no need to download any driver mozilla firefox driver is default driver in web driver you can create directly okay next download download and install test ng from eclipse ide not from physical hard disk generally we download softwares from our hard disk but here download and install test ng from eclipse ide see in eclipse ide you can find download option for test ng install option download and install test ng framework from eclipse ide test ng testing framework from eclipse ide <coughs> see our environment is ready see first we selected uh, selenium, uh, selenium tools and other other tools and configure can you tell me the steps mohammad rahman as per our selection web driver java test ng tell me the steps first of all we need to download eclipse id and extract the folder ah then we need to download java and install ah then we need to set the environment variable path mm. this is another name for bad variable which ah. make it global ah make download it global selenium. make java global in our computer okay yes sir download ah. selenium web driver ah. java language binding ah. and add web driver ah. jar file to java project ah. in which is configured in selenium hq.org okay in in Eclipse. Eclipse. okay next then download and install firebug and firepath ah. for mozilla browser ah. which help us to inspect elements such mm. as eft mm. uh, what's called this object spy okay then Next. download mm. download ie chrome uh, browser drivers ah. but mozilla we don't need to download because yes. it's uh, that is built in, in web driver browser. you can directly create in web driver ah. yes sir and finally download and install test ng framework from eclipse id good <coughs> good okay now yes. srivalli any confusion no theoretical steps practically i will show and you can configure selenium in your missions also that that we will discuss later <clears throat> okay next what is the next topic advantages and disadvantages of selenium see yesterday indirectly we discussed now clear picture <clears throat> 
ఫస్ట్ శ్రీలక్ష్మి కాంట్రిబ్యూషన్ తెలమీ శ్రీలక్ష్మి వన్ ఆర్ టూ అడ్వాంటేజ్ ఆఫ్ సెలీనియం యూజింగ్ సెలీనియం యూ కెన్ టెస్ట్ వెబ్ వెబ్ అప్లికేషన్స్ దట్ ఈస్ అడ్వాంటేజ్ ఈజ్ ఇట్ అడ్వాంటేజ్ దట్ ఈస్ వన్ డ్రాబ్యాక్ ఓన్లీ వెబ్ అప్లికేషన్స్ దట్ ఈస్ డ్రాబ్యాక్ యా యా సారీ సర్ ఓకే కూల్ కూల్ ఫస్ట్ ఇట్ సపోర్ట్స్ మల్టిపుల్ లాంగ్వేजेस ఆ yes before that it is open source na no license cost yeah. that is advantage yeah. or not yeah it's a big advantage big advantage see it is an open source open source software for example you take uft unified functional testing formerly qtp that is vendor software vendor hp license is required suppose rft rft from ibm vendor software license is required but for selenium no license cost freeware next uh, vijaya contribute it is open source anybody can download and use with free of cost this is one major advantage next contribute vijaya advantage of selenium just a try uh try you it 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 can be installed only in the firefox browser which is a disadvantage what i am asking uh, advantages uh Advant- you can create the test okay cool 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 toshar tell me one or two advantages of selenium uh it support many uh, browsers and also operating system good <clears throat> see it supports various operating environments operating environments example windows linux mac etc whereas eft supports only windows operating environment next saujanya <coughs> contribute selenium supports various browsers yes it supports various browsers it supports <coughs> various browsers and it also supports ie mozilla uh, mozilla firefox chrome next uh, important one google chrome next uh, safari opera etc opera etc ah uh, next and it also supports various programming environments yes, to various write the... programming environments to write programs where eft supports only vb script vb scripting okay cool put mute see it supports various programming programming environments for example java perl python <coughs> ruby and php okay <coughs> next three only contribute శ్రీవల్లి శ్రీలక్ష్మి ఓకే కృష్ణ చైతన్య కృష్ణ చైతన్య 
it supports parallel test execution good that is also one of the advantage it supports parallel parallel test execution next one more advantage when it compares to other tools in this category functional and regression testing when it compares to others to other tools uft rft silk test etc it uses less hardware resources so high in performance it consumes less hardware resources why no built in no huge amount of built in features most of the time we use programming only so it uses less hardware resources gayatri anything else market advantage sir uh, help documentation is more for uh, selenium compared to i mean in, in the sense that uh, in case if you use java uh, for that actually um, market advantage is more sir uh, what about uft uft also vb script also vendor vendor uh, vendor script na microsoft is providing huge documentation for vb script and support also na that is not advantage see java mm -hmm. having huge amount of documentation but vb script also take uft or rft and any other tool they also having right required documentation okay these are the important advantages of selenium next sri lakshmi disadvantages uh, it supports only uh, web browser applications only yes browser based applications okay. see it supports web based web based applications if it is computer web application or mobile web application computer web application or mobile web, mobile web application it supports web based applications only this is one drawback next tushar So sharp. Yeah, uh, one thing is uh, it does not have a help uh, text or help help. support from Windows. Say, uh, since it is open source software, no reliable technical support from anybody. Getting this point? Ah uh, yes. Say, since it is. Uh, Uh, open source software no reliable technical support from anybody no guarantee suppose if you face any problems at middle of the project nobody can provide reliable support you can get support from other resources but not reliable if it is vendor tool uft vendor provides reliable technical support vendor provides reliable technical support that is the responsibility of the vendor here no responsible person say no reliable no reliable technical support or you can say support no reliable support from anybody next <coughs> Rahman contribute <coughs> disadvantage of selenium so to me one more thing is it, is it has no centralized maintenance support uh, okay. for object like yes. in uft no centralized no centralized good no centralized maintenance no centralized maintenance of elements are objects suppose if it is uft uft having object repository you can maintain 
objects in a centralized location in EFT. But in Selenium, no centralized maintenance of objects. Next, Gayatri. Complex architecture sites because it's a suite of tools, uh, it involves a lot of complexity. A suit of Using tools, this. okay. You select the required tool only. Suppose I don't want Selenium RC, I don't want Selenium ID, I want only Selenium web driver, then what is the complexity? So, as uh, when we take, when we consider UFT, uh, everything is available in one place. Yes. Maybe it's uh, kind uh, of. Here, configuration means environment setup is difficult. Difficult to set up Selenium environment, isn't it? Yes, sir. See? Yes, sir. Oh, good, good. <clears throat> Difficult to set up environment say if it is EFT just download EFT software from HP and install VB script and other tool features all can be installed at a time you no need to download any other tools and install you just download EFT software from HP site and install all required components can be installed at a time but here not like that you need to download uh, Eclipse IDE for platform next Java for programming Selenium web driver bindings for test case design test ng framework for test runner next uh, firebug firepath plugins for inspecting elements etc See, difficult to set up environment. Uh, this is one drawback. Next, difficult to use. Say, if you select Selenium web driver, in Selenium web driver, no IDE, no menus, no menu items, no features. You just write program for every operation. Suppose if it is UFT or RFT or silk test, they have IDs as well as editors. You suppose I want to generate test script in UFT, I can use recording feature or I can type statements. Suppose I want to insert verification points in UFT, for that I can use VB script conditional statements or UFT tool feature checkpoints. But here, no tool features. For each and everything, we need to write the code. Uh, for example, if you take Selenium IDE, a yes, Selenium IDE having a built-in features, but not suitable for complex test design. Only, only for simple test case design. Why? Selenium IDE having recording feature, recording and playback features, but no programming support. If it is UFT or RFT or silk test or any other functional test automation tool, they support a tool, uh, they provide tool features as well as support programming features. Okay. <clears throat> Difficult to use when it compares to other tools. Next, limited support. Limited support for image testing image based testing next Gayatri anything else new uh, features uh, may not uh, new work features may not generally. work properly no guarantee if it is UFT or RFT vendor provides support Vendor is responsible for new features. See. New features may not work. May work, may not work. But no guarantee. May not work properly. Uh, anything else, Gayatri? Yes, sir. Uh, tools integration also. No other tools integration. Uh, uh, no in, other uh, tools uh, integration. 
Suppose if it is EFT tool, EFT can be integrated with ALM for test management. Here no tool for integ uh, no no tool integration for test management. We need to select other tools and uh, use independently. See. No other tool integration. No other tool integration for test management. For test management. Anything? Anything else? Uh, I'm not sure how far uh, this is a big disadvantage, but yesterday I remember you mentioned uh, that it doesn't generate a detailed test report. Yes, it that is a very major summary. drawback only. Uh, okay. Yes, major drawback, not simple one, major. Suppose you take EFT, EFT can generate detailed test report, HTML report, XML report, not only summary. And one more facility also there in EFT. Uh, that facility is you can define test results if you want otherwise EFT provides test result for every test iteration if we use tool features uh, what is that one no no built-in no built-in reporting facility no built-in reporting facility uh, if you take selenium web driver or selenium ide no built-in reporting facility for that we need to depend on test ngr j unit okay we we can overcome that disadvantage we can overcome but selenium itself doesn't provide reporting facility see these are the <coughs> anything else gayatri we covered maximum now Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, cool. Now tell me, Rahman, uh, before moving to next topic, first uh, tell me the advantage of Selenium. Advantage of Selenium, first of all, it's a open source. Open it's source. Of cost, we can of cost download anybody can download and use. Okay. Yes, sir. Next. It supports it support various programming language. languages. Languages, supports various browsers, okay. supports various operating environments. Next. Yeah. It supports uh, various browsers such ah. as Mozilla Firefox, Chrome, mm. IE, Safari, Opera. Mm. Uh, Selenium, I say, I forgot. Mm. Mm. Continue to share. Disadvantage of mm. Selenium. Disadvantages. See, advantage. Uh, yeah, you forgot yeah. two. Just a minute. Two advantages. Uh, Rahman supports parallel test execution. It uses less hardware resources, high in performance. Ah, continue, Tushar. Disadvantages are drawbacks of Selenium. Yeah, it only supports uh, web applications ah. and and also uh, does not have reliable technical support. Uh, and uh, it does not have centralized maintenance, maintenance of, of objects or elements. Yeah, and uh, it's difficult to uh, set up the environment uh, and uh, difficult to use because uh, no tool is available. Uh, no built in features. And, uh, uh, yeah, and uh, it has limited support for image testing. Good. And the uh, new features may not work, may not work properly. Yeah, and uh, no other integration to quotas management. Uh, and uh, no built-in reporting facility. Yes, no built-in test reporting facility. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> See. Okay, now Srivalli, shall we move to next topic? Any confusion? Yeah. No, I'm good. See, I already mentioned nine only. Next one more topic. Uh, yesterday, I told Selenium and UFT are market competitors in this area of testing, functional and regression testing. 
okay we are learning selenium tool we are learning selenium and going to use selenium only but you need to familiar with other competitors other tools just understanding purpose selenium versus uft see you can easily differentiate selenium versus uft see selenium uft formerly qtp <clears throat> okay ah <clears throat> uh, sri lakshmi contribute selenium versus uft yeah. <coughs> first point yeah. it is open source na yes sir open source what about uh, uft it's a license ah uh, vendor yeah. tool license is required ah uh, next vijaya yeah um it supports various operating systems uh, yes. selenium however you yes. uh, have supports only the good uh, supports wind various os operating system os environments whereas eft supports microsoft windows only microsoft windows only next krishna chaitanya krishna chaitanya contribute selenium uses various programming languages yes supports various, various programming languages supports various programming environments okay what about uft it supports only vb script yes vb script vb script only <coughs> next rahman contribute so it it doesn't have uh, uh, like object equals to centralized centralized okay uh, and support but uh, eft have yes centralized no centralized object repository uh okay no object repositories no object repositories here it has we have repository. local and shared object repositories shared object repositories for centralized maintenance Uh, next uh, tushar selenium does not have a detail uh, uh, test report generation okay but uft does good no built in no built in reporting facility no built in reporting feature say built in reporting a reporting feature uh, saujanya selenium doesn't have tool support but you have to have a tool support what tool support 
I mean, like, you know, like, uh, it has menu and, like, you know, all the tools support, like, okay, uh, but tool still, features. it doesn't have ID. tool features, sir. Tool features. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Next, uh, Selenium IDE have some tool features, but Selenium WebDriver only not having tool features. Selenium WebDriver, WebDriver has no IDE. Next, if it is Selenium IDE, as no programming interface. If you select a web driver, programming interface is there, but no IDE. If you select Selenium IDE, no programming interface but IDE. Uh, if it is EFT, EFT has both IDE and programming interface. Uh, Sri Lakshmi, she uses less hardware resources. Uses more hardware resources. Yes. Sri Lakshmi, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Uh, tell me. Next, <clears throat> difficult to set up. Difficult to set up environment. and use difficult to use difficult to set up and difficult to use next easy to set up and use next <clears throat> limited support limited support for image testing next rich support a rich support for image testing next <clears throat> no reliable support next <clears throat> support from hp next <clears throat> no other tool integration integration for test management next UFT UFT can be integrated with ALM application lifecycle management formerly QC quality center for 
टेस्ट मैनेजमेंट टेस्ट मैनेजमेंट से इफ यू इंटीग्रेट यू एफ टी विथ एल एम यू कैन डायरेक्टली सेंड डिफेक्ट फ्रॉम यू एफ टी रिजल्ट विंडो टू एल एम प्रोजेक्ट हियर नो अदर टूल इंटीग्रेशन इन सेलिनियम नेक्स्ट न्यू फीचर्स just a minute new features may not work properly may work may not work no guarantee next new features will work properly otherwise vendor can take care about it otherwise vendor can take care uh, anything else uh, gayatri we covered maximum anything else yes sir yes sir one more i feel i think no. add ins are not required uh, uh, in selenium uh, mean, in selenium uh, no add ins in required but for in eft add ins required yes yeah. see <clears throat> no add ins for supporting application environments no add in for supporting application environments here add ins are required for supporting application environments uh vijaya you try to understand this last topic last point okay suppose if you want to test java application using uft for that java add in required that is extra cost say uft provides four add ins only with basic license uh, st standard windows web activex and visual basic if you want uh, any other add in extra extra cost for example i want to test sap application for that sap add in required in uft after installing sap add in only uft can recognize sap objects sap application objects suppose i want to test a .net application using uft .net add in required i want to test people soft application people soft add in required uh for selenium no add ins required if it is web application irrespective of the application technology you can test if it is java application or dot net application any application but here some drawbacks are there only supports web based applications but no add ins required using element locators you can identify all web elements got this point vijaya any confusion no i'm good thanks okay cool uh, gayatri observe these points we covered maximum anything else uh no sir okay cool uh, uh, no that's okay yeah. can uh, sri lakshmi observe Selenium supports only web-based application, whereas UFT supports desktop and web-based applications. Ah, yes, that is also one point. We didn't uh, mention, na? No? Okay. Supports web 
web applications only next <coughs> supports desktop and web applications see nowadays latest versions of uft supports mobile applications also but not all mobile applications uh, hybrid applications native applications uh, some limitations are there for mobile testing using uft but they are increasing the capabilities Na, uh, latest versions of uft supports mobile applications also but our selenium also supports mobile applications which are having web forms okay ah selakshmi anything else Uh, sir, authorized certifications also we can do. Uh, the, 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 no authorized certifications from Selenium. Ah, uh, yes. Who is telling? Gayatri, sir. Okay, cool, cool. Good. See, no authorized certification means uh, no uh, certifying facility. for selenium but hp certifies uft professionals say <coughs> authorized certification program okay Okay, now Tushar, we covered maximum points for Selenium. Uh, observe this last point for Selenium. No authorized certification exam or program. Uh, nowadays, some organizations conducting, some organizations are conducting uh, Selenium certification programs, but no value guarantee in the IT industry. No value guarantee for Selenium certification. why no authorized program but set, uh, for uh, uft value guarantee why hp conducts certification program certification exam okay na tushar yes sir i have small question uh, the uft support api testing right yes so... yes that is also an api testing and gi testing yeah that is also an uh, advantage of uft but most of the testers using uh, uft for gi testing only gi testing of desktop and web applications okay na rahman uh, yes sir i found one more difference ah. between them like selenium doesn't have editor tools but uft itself is editor tools selenium it is doesn't have editor tools yeah who told we use eclipse ide you na know? eclipse id is ah uh, we use eclipse id it, it, for it, writing it, it, java it, it, programs na eclipse id provides editor tools na yes but it's it's under selenium tools suit so uh, it's out so suppose selenium id no programming support so no editor tool support required no support selenium rc forget about that that is outdated we are going to use selenium web driver selenium we deploy selenium web driver in eclipse editor eclipse ide eclipse ide provides editor tools then what is the problem selenium grid not for test design then what is the problem hello so no my question is yes sir ah tell so, me tell uh, me eclipse id is not under selenium tools not tool. under selenium okay okay your question is good it is not under selenium but we take support from uh, eclipse yes that is also one drawback but we can overcome that drawback okay we we can overcome reporting facility drawback also using testng okay that is also one drawback 
but we can overcome the drawback using selling uh, using eclipse id okay na sure. yeah definitely uh, anything uh, else uh, uh. And anything else is also similar like this but uft has object is pi uh. but Okay. Suit. See, like, like that. If you segregate, so many things are there. But uh, yeah. you are yeah. concentrating on important things, focusing on important things. See, Selenium ID. Uh, sorry, Selenium doesn't have inbuilt uh, object spy. Uh, but uh, you can take support uh, from browsers, browser add-ins, Firebug, Firepath, Firebug. if it is IER, Google Chrome. <coughs> built-in developer tools etc okay that uh, we also covered yes. what is that one it doesn't have IDE EFT has both IDE and editor uh, editor in the topic you can cover all the features okay now yes sir I think so see this is about uh, first uh, chapter introduction to selenium yesterday we discussed three topics today we discussed uh, seven topics total we covered uh, 10 topics okay we'll meet tomorrow same time thank you tomorrow uh, we will discuss selenium test process okay any queries srivalli i'm going to close the session any queries uh, no anybody tushar or vijaya uh, no, sir. No, uh, I'm good. Thank you so much. Okay. We'll meet tomorrow, same time. Thank you.